the vibe up a little bit. I don't even know when the last time. So last week I didn't really vlog. Right now, currently I'm in Colorado. But this is the condo. For those of you who don't remember or haven't seen like the snowboarding vlogs where we stay here, this is the condo. This is where we're gonna be living. Last week, spent most of the week packing, did a couple of tattoos back in Vegas. <laughs> really getting close to when we're actually leaving. But I needed to come down here, up here, around here. I needed to come here. Well, so, okay, a few things have happened. All right, so, as you know, my friend Peter passed away. This is where he lived. This is where he had a tattoo shop. He worked with this guy, Chris, and this other guy, Alex. But Chris is now who owns the shop. So me and Chris don't really know each other. We maybe think we met once before, like in passing, but we're not really sure. Regardless, we haven't spent any time together. But this week, we sort of called an emergency, like, hey, come down now so we can figure this out situation. Basically this week is just me and Chris hanging out and tattooing and just kind of making sure that we're on the same page, that we have the same vibe, you know, that this is gonna work. Cause the last thing that we wanna do is something that's not gonna work. I'm up here tatting, getting ready, taking measurements, seeing what we can fit in this house. Cause it ain't gonna be a lot. We're getting rid of most of what we own. Basically gonna spend this morning drawing, getting stuff going for my appointments. 12 hours in the test, so I almost ran out of battery, but we made it, we're here and we're enjoying ourselves. I can't for the life of me figure out how the fuck y'all let me move to Vegas. I mean, I know you can't tell me anything, but still, someone should have intervened. Fucking hummingbird. So I'm back at the condo. The last couple days have been a little hard to film. Me and Chris are really getting to know each other, you know? And I'm tattooing people I don't really know. I'm kind of in a place where I don't know anybody <laughs> anymore. So I'm getting to know everybody and it's not really that easy to vlog. That being said, it is what it is. I haven't even been eating. I've had a burrito every day. I had a breakfast burrito, I had a steak burrito, and I had a chicken burrito. Tonight I got pizza. I got this in the middle of the day. So we got pizza that will warm up later. Wings. You can see I haven't eaten shit. It's like one wing. It's been too busy. There's so much going on. A lot to process. Not the easiest. You know, it's just there's a lot. Like, it's a lot. My friend is gone. Uh, his stuff, his artwork is surrounding me. I'm meeting his friend and we have this all this in common. We have stories to exchange. It's just like, it's a lot. It's a lot to go through. It's nighttime, I'm going to bed pretty early out here. I'm usually in bed by like 10 or 11. Right now I'm gonna go ahead to Walmart. Big exciting because uh, I need a pillow. Pillows up here are horrible and my neck is killing me. It's gorgeous out here. The weather is amazing, incredible. The mountains are like staring at you in the fucking face. It's like right there, it's like this big reminder that you ain't shit. Big ass fucking gargantuan rock just staring at you like, look at you, you little bitch ass human. I love seeing it. Nature, I almost got hit by a hummingbird. Moose, meese, I don't know how you say it. Walking around, bears, birds, trees, trees. Vegas ain't got trees. I'm excited, things are good. We're getting prepared for the move. Alex is back home, it sounds like. She's getting a lot done, so shout out to her. 
for that. Time to head to Wally World. So it's the morning, I got a new pillow, clutch, I slept so good. I have not slept like well in really like a week. It's been pretty rough. It's been kind of driving me crazy. A lot to be said for rest and I guess mother nature. I, you know, I didn't think I was a hippy dippy like this, but dude, I feel so much better up here. The energy, the nature, air, scenery. Brought my bike and I've had zero chance to ride it. Bike riding here is incredible. I'll probably go tomorrow morning. I've been working on projects still, like lookbook, the drop. Uh, I have an NFT project that I'm trying to get situated. Still doing a million things, so I'm trying to keep up with the vlog too. I'm gonna be honest, the last month, two months, maybe even three, has kind of sent me in a little bit of an emotional tailspin. It's really opened my eyes to like a lot of things that I need to do, and a lot of things I was doing that I don't need to do, and just uh, how I want to carry forward with my life. Uh, yeah. We are home, it is like nine o'clock. We've not eaten shit. We went and got a place called Taco, spelled T-O-C-K-O. Chips, guac, I haven't eaten anything today. Starving, got a burrito, good to go. Good morning, it is uh, like 9.30. I'm gonna attempt to go on a bike ride before the shop, a quick one. I've never ridden my bike in Frisco. It's gonna be incredible for sure, but I'm not gonna go far, because uh, I don't know where I'm going and I gotta be at the shop. Hello. Hello. Oh my goodness. Hello. Hello. Yay. Hello. Bye bye. Bye bye. You miss me? Probably so fucking happy to see you. You miss me? It's been so mopey. You miss me? Of course, all my things getting packed. Oh, bye bye. You miss me? You miss me? You miss me? I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Oof. Hi, fluffy boy. Hi, fluffy boy. I know. 